Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 6th of December 2025. I hope you are keeping well, enjoying life as best you possibly can. It's obituary day again. Oh yeah, I have to report the death of somebody else. Seems like people are passing so quickly. Uh, that's going to be Frank Gehry. Uh, American, actually born in Canada. I didn't realize that. I thought he was just an American, but he was born in Canada, moved to America in the 1940s, and of course became a very famous architect. Uh, probably Frank Gehry and Frank Lloyd Wright are the two biggest American architect names that come to mind if you ever imagine. If you say American architect to the general public, probably Frank Gehry is one of two, along with Frank Lloyd Wright that is the other. Uh, I guess, um, and uh, of course known for his very playful buildings, playful shapes and stuff like that, some of which I, in my opinion, worked very well and some of which really didn't. <laughs> I must admit, I have a bit of a love-hate relationship with his buildings. I think some of them are excellent, some of them are not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not such a fan on some of them, um, but anyway, that's my opinion, and I'm not uh, an architecture expert, although I do love... Uh, architecture and uh, buildings and design and stuff like that. I've, uh, I used to be a keen amateur follower of it. Uh, let's get on with the game of Sudoku then. This is oh by the way he made it to the age of ninety six. Sorry I forgot to mention he made it to ninety six, which is a pretty good run it seems to me. Uh, let's get on with the game of Sudoku. New York Times hard level puzzle. How hard is it going to be today? We are we are always wondering. Just how tough is the game going to be? Some days very tough, some days a kitten. Today, tiger or kitten? Let's find out. We're going to start with seven in this square here. And we've got sevens blocking to the top like this. That's going to give me a seven there. And we go seven down here, seven across there, seven across that way. God, my eyes are off. That's, I thought I saw... Ah, that's okay. There's a 1 and a 5 across here. That's going to put 1 and 5 into those squares. We've got 1 blocking down. That will be our 1. That will be our 5. Five across this way, this way, and five down here. There's a five. Five blocking down here and going up in this direction and across here like this. So we know that fives are in one of these two empty squares here. So that will block down here. This five blocks this square. This five blocks this square. So in this row, that's the only possibility for a five. And we've got five down here, down here, and across there. Uh, we haven't finished. F oh, actually, silly me. Five. I could actually place the five up here. I didn't realize that's the last one. Okay. Missing numbers here, 2, 3, and 6, I think. So 2 and 6 in the same column. That's got to be a 3. Another pair. We've got 8 and 9 blocking up here. That's going to put 8 and 9 into those squares. Uh, which is which? Mm, don't, sh don't know. This is not 8 or 9. What is it going to be? Uh, 3. Three, four, I think. Okay, so threes there, four. Okay, four blocking down here, four down here, and four across there. And there's our four. Four blocking this way and this way. There's a four. One blocking this square and this square. Here's a one.
nine blocking oh it's not nine <laughs> i thought we needed six and nine but it no it's not correct it's six and eight that we need in those squares my apologies six and eight we need there Okay, six blocking down here and across there. That means six is in one of those two squares blocking up. That gives me six in that square and gives me a two in this square. I wasn't, I wasn't looking at twos there, I was looking at something else, but then I noticed, hey, we can grab that two there, can't we? I don't know if this is useful, but we've got 9 and 1 blocking down here. That means that 9 and 1 are in those two squares there. And this can't be 9 or 1. It's got to be 2, 6, 8. Uh, we've got 2 and a 6 there. The 8s I don't know about really. 2, 6, 8. Should we see if we can get anything from the... Oh! <laughs> okay, 2 there. 6 blocking across there. There's a 6 and there's the 8. I almost missed that. The fact that there were a couple of them there. I was about to say not much going on there. I was going to look up here, but anyway, I will look up here now, now that I've discovered that. So that's three, four, and seven. Seven's there. Three, four, I don't know. Oh, I'm getting a call. Uh, let me. Oh, I'm gonna have to pause the game. Hold on. Uh, okay, I'm back, and that was a very short interruption, so shouldn't have lost too much concentration. Uh, but when I now I notice there's a single number missing here that I didn't. I don't think I noticed before when I, before the phone call. But anyway, there we go. It's got to be an eight, hasn't it, for that row? And then we've got eight and. 8 blocking up here, so that's our 8. I remember this was 8, 9 in those squares there, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, you can see the 9 blocking up there. There we go. 9 blocks across here, across there, up here, and up there. And there's a 9. And... Uh, nine blocking down here there's the nine there and this is three and six so six across there there's the six there's a three okay now eight and three block across here like that that puts eight and three into those squares it means that that must be a one one back that way there's the one there's the nine is it yes okay nine blocking up here down there didn't need that one actually nine across there that's good enough nine there five and nine are now finished digits they are deceased defunct like dead parrot four blocks up here that's going to be a four and this is going to be a t not a two this is going to be an eight
two, three, four missing in this block. We got two, we got a three, we got a four there. One blocks across here though, and that's got to be a one blocking up there. That will give me one there, one blocking to the top, and one across here. There's our digit one, one across here, across there, up there. One five nine now finished. I think it might be worthwhile clicking on the digits actually, just seeing I don't know if, which is the best way forward. Or uh, yeah, let's just click on the numbers and see what we've got left. Okay, yep, yeah, we've got two blocking up here, two across there, so two in one of those squares blocking down. Or just a much simpler way is just to say two blocks that square there, and we needed two in this column. Of course, an easier way of doing it. That will be a three that we need in this column now. Three also blocks up here. There's a three, and this is a four. Uh, like I say, we'll just click on the numbers and see where it takes us. Two blocks across there, that's a two. Two blocks up here. Up there, across there, there's two. This game is over, I think. Uh, a very simple game, not at all like the New York Times uh, usually is, I think. Three. Six we need. Six blocking up here, across there, there's a six. Six across here, across there, and up here. Six down and up. Uh, seven blocking up here, up there. Seven across this way, up there. Okay, the last number to get in this column is four, I think. And four blocks across there, that gives me four in that square. Four blocking across here and up there, there's a four. Uh, the last number in this column is eight. Eight blocks across there, there's our eight. This is three. That's a three missing there. Three blocking down there, there's a three. Finish with the eight there, and this is eight, and this is three, and it's all over. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you another time for another game of Sudoku. Thank you for joining me. Bye bye.